<laughs> this is the Bourbon Lounge with Wayne in with Travis Hartman. I'm B-Money, the producer. That over there is the talent. Weekend Trav, Weekend Trav. We've been doing these segments for a couple weeks now, so we're trying to keep it going. Uh, we will drink this in the podcast episode that drops uh, that dropped a couple days prior to this. But this is the Bourbon Lounge where we actually pick this bourbon apart. Truth be told, Weekend Trav, I've had this bottle for several months just hanging out in a, in a, in a whiskey cabin at home uh, that I have. And so why don't you show the, the camera at home what we are partaking in today. This is B Money's What What. Yeah, I'm a, there there you go. go. Oh, there you go. Or, that's why I needed that light up there. there okay, so Weekend Trav, this is Yellowstone. Now, you can get Yellowstone at almost any liquor store, but this is one of their hand-picked bottles, hand of all things, from November... 20, uh, 2017, it looks like, is when it was barreled. This is mm-hmm. Sam's special edition because, you know, a family man, you need to go to Sam's and go to Sam's Liquor get his thing. But I, I can't remember how much I paid for this weekend, Trav. I think it was like 60 65 bucks, maybe something like that. I think it's going for way more than that now, though, right? Uh, I think some other barrels are, but I'm not sure about that one in particular. But Yellowstone. So, obviously, this isn't the normal labeled Yellowstone bottle of bourbon. But we have yet to try any of it, folks. This is the first sip right here. On the Bourbon Lounge. So Cheers, let's brother. do it. Neat on ice. When weekend Trav is doing the neats, though. Hmm. That, um, here's how I'm going to describe this weekend Trav before we do any of our usual shenanigans of rating. Mm-hmm. I'm going to describe this as the double edged sword. Okay. Okay. It has that sharp flavor, that sharp taste. But then, if you get through that, you get the sweetness factor that comes right through it. But then, the heat stays with you. I'm not going to lie. My eyes are watering. <clears throat> when I breathed it in really yeah. close and took a drink, it, like, it was... But it, it's not... A sp- that's, that's really like pungent. kind of stings the nostrils. Yeah. And it might, it's, it might be a little bit different though, that you're doing it neat. Mine's fine on ice. It didn't really bother uh, the the nasal passage. But the palate, I would say, double-edged sword. Are you getting like an oaky taste or no? Is that just me? Or like a... A little bit. I don't know what it is. But, I but it like stays. So hmm. for a nice hot Florida March day, <laughs> this, is, this is not exactly what I was hoping to have up here while it's warm in this uh, in this room. Uh, in the in the lounge, the bourbon. Yeah, lounge. I would say this isn't one of those like smooth, like easy to drink ones. But it's not bad. In my opinion, it's not bad. I actually 100 percent agree with that. We, it's we just not we'll what. We'll probably finish this. I don't think it is a. I don't know. How, I don't think you can drink a lot of these. No, no. This is more of a for sure one, maybe two glasses to sip on. Yeah, I think because because of this very good. But I'm talking about like the easy drinkability. I don't think it's, I don't yeah, think it's, it's not, easy to drink. It's not super smooth. You gotta you gotta yeah. enjoy some of the harshness behind it, which I do actually. It's got some good flavor though. But it has flavor, has a couple layers of flavor to that. Like I said, you get a little heat still with it, and even lasts, it lingers. Correct? Mm-hmm, it does. Like breathe in, breathe out. Yeah, it's still there. Yeah. So <clears throat> we can trav. This is the Yellowstone, once again, Yellowstone. Uh, their handpicked collection, barrel from two, 2017, it looks like. The, that's Sam's special edition on this one. Uh, you want to pull the cork again? I love doing that. All right, let's, 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 do, she that. Said. let's do that. Ready? Yeah. Oh, he likes that. There we go. Uh, we can trap. So we always rate Doesn't these. Much just to make me happy. Yeah, you know, simple, simple pleasures. Uh, so we rate these zero to ten boxing gloves. We can trap. I'm going to throw it to you first on the rating. Mm. Now, what what are your criteria today? Oh, today the criteria. Let's see. It's I have three. Yeah. I forget what they are all the time, but it's how I feel. How you feel? Okay. Um. Um. Two, and um three. Okay. <laughs> I, <laughs> um. It's how it tastes, how I feel, um, what we're talking about. It all kind of goes it goes with the mood. I need to have the a mood. It's a mood setting bourbon um but here we go i'm gonna go with a it was a little it was good it's very flavorful but i'm gonna go a little bit on the low end and i'm gonna go right at seven i'm gonna give it a 7.0 which is not really low 
It's not but really low. It's the lowest one I've rated for little bits, but it's not really low, and I don't want people to be discouraged by that. It's just right now my mood, and maybe I'm getting a cold too because I do sound a little nasally right now. I'm, I'm just hearing it. Hmm. I do a little bit. So maybe that's throwing it off, but I'm going with the seven. A lot of tree pollen out there here in Florida. I'm going with the seven. Okay, I'm going to go Lucky with seven. six and a half boxing gloves, which gives us an average rating of 6.75 boxing gloves on this one, which is I'm typically the harsher rater on this anyways, or rater when it comes to these things anyways. Um, once again, that's not a bad score necessarily for me. Um, I just think you have to be in the right mood to drink this. This isn't an everyday drinker in my opinion, but... One or two glasses here and there. Put it on the cabinet. Put it on the shelf. Yeah. You know, and that's okay. And it has a cool name, right? Yeah. I guess Yellowstone. I got to watch that show. I never, have you ever watched that? Oh, I love it. There you, you go. You watch Yellowstone? No. Oh, that needs to be I, better, I, I watch a lot of other stuff. Yellowstone's really good. I know, but I'm in the middle of watching other watch stuff. It. I got all these anime things I'm watching, all sorts of crazy. Okay. So we can trap. We're going to close up this Bourbon Lounge segment <laughs> the same way that I close the prior ones down to... And that is this, my tagline. It's sterile, and I like the taste. That there is Weekend Trav. I'm B-Money, the producer. Make sure you subscribe to our content below. Thank you so much for joining us on the Bourbon Lounge with Wayne and with Travis Hartman. The Boom Boom Lounge. I mean the Bourbon Lounge.